over the last three to five years, it's just been this amazing rate of discovery where we're getting new drugs all the time, new breakthroughs in understanding the basic science of cancers, which is leading to very rapid turnaround in developing new therapeutics. We provide a lot of community services, education, and they can come here and get free services, and it's a wonderful place. That's where I think we go the extra step, an extra mile. So I'm one of our medical oncologists. There's no one specific cancer type that we take care of. We are UCSF faculty, and there's a partnership that's been formed between both Washington Hospital as well as UCSF. So the goal is to be able to provide high-level care, access to cutting-edge treatments, close to home rather than having to commute all the way into San Francisco. We're doing many things here to improve patient care and we really focus on the patient and the families. It's not just the patients, it's like family-centered care too. You need to take the initiative when your doctor talks to you about screening tests because now if there is a cancer that's discovered, it can be early stage before there's any symptoms you can be treated and the chances of cure can be excellent. I think one of the things that we focus on is to make sure we individualize our treatment, we make sure we figure out exactly what type of cancer we're dealing with, don't look at it as a generic cancer, don't look at a person as a generic patient and make sure that we really hone in on the best available therapies and individualize that treatment. Hi, I'm good. I was diagnosed in June with a stage four breast cancer. And now um, I'm on remission. And at first I was really scared because I knew I have it after the biopsy. And so on. that was uh, a metastatic breast cancer already uh, when they find out. And Dr. Lee said, we'll have to go, you know, um, schedule a treatment for you. So the way he explained it to me is really like, I didn't get scared anymore, the way he talked to me. And then uh, I felt like, oh, there is treatment that I have hope. If not for my hair, I wouldn't even realize I had a cancer. When my hair started to fall down, that's the only time it seemed to me that I have a cancer. I'm so thankful. Every time I see him, I just want to hug him and, thank you, Dr. Lee. <laughs> I'm so happy every time I see Dr. Lee. So when the patients come in, they kind of light up and they feel like, oh, I can be okay, I can breathe. I know my nurse is gonna take good care of me. I know the doctors here are outstanding. They're, they have great bedside manner. All of our physicians here, um, wonderful. You know, I think when it comes to treating patients, most doctors are used to working in a teamwork. We all collaborate to take care of patients. But we're seeing it now with larger systems, like with UCSF and Washington Hospital, recognizing we can do better we can work better together, trying to create an atmosphere where patients feel welcome, where they feel like their families are treated with dignity and respect, treated with individuals where they feel safe and comfortable. I'm here for infusion for my uh, treatment of the pancreatic cancer, uh, the, and uh, the taking care of the Dr. David Lee. Dr. Lee offer is, is amazing. Is, um, he could explain to me every word, what I'm going through and what's the treatment I'm getting and what is the plan and throughout he explained me everything. It's very, very good. For me it's right now it's a transportation not the main issue because my wife helped me a lot to drive me around here and there for doctor appointments. But at least the Washington Hospital do have some services offer me for the the transportations, the, you know, um, not only for the transportation, also for the emotional stress, counseling. She's not my wife, she's also my angel. She helped me a lot. Look around, look at it. These are all people. They always not only have been the patients, they want treated like the family members. And this is a very, very fortunate to have a center in the Fremont area. Those are what we call our patients. You know, our patients are actually real life people with loved ones that they are doing the best for. 
And when you see that and you see it every day, you want to do the best that you can for them. Honestly, I leave work and I look forward to coming back to work. It's rewarding to know that you made a difference in someone's life. So for me, it's an honor to be a part of that journey with them. Learn more at BayAreaHealthierTogether.com.